Hi, I'm Dr. Mohan Kumar. I'm a consultant urologist and renal transplant surgeon at Manipal Hospitals Yashwanpur and Hebal. Uh, today I'm here to debunk the myths about uh, prevention and formation of renal stones. There are lots of hearsay and myths about the formation of uh, renal stones. Even though calcium is a major component of most of the renal stones, calcium taken in the food can actually prevent the formation of stones as calcium in the diet actually binds with the oxalate and prevents the uh, absorption of oxalate from the gut. So calcium taken along with the food can actually prevent the formation of stones. Cranberry juice and its extracts can actually prevent the uh, urinary tract infections. But in reality, cranberry juice contains a lot of oxalate. So excess consumption of cranberry juice can actually lead to formation of renal stones. While well, banana stem juice acts as a diuretic and helps in flushing out small stones which are blocking the tube. But there is no evidence which stays, uh, states that banana stem juice consumption can actually prevent the formation of renal stones. Like banana stem juice, beer is also a diuretic and it can help in mechanically flushing small stones which are blocking the tube. But you have to understand that beer causes dehydration and acidification of urine. So actually consumption of beer will lead to formation of stones rather than prevention of stones. Not all stones will require surgery. Uh, the need for surgery depends on various factors such as size and the location of the stones. Stones as big as 7 to 8 millimeters in the kidney can be managed conservatively. Even stones in the urinary tube can be managed conservatively and we can see if the stone passes. Only if the stone doesn't pass even after a couple of weeks of managing conservatively, then we'll require surgery. This is a very important misconception. The chances of forming a patient forming the stone again is as high as 50% in 5 to 10 years. So stone is not a one-time phenomenon. It can recur again and again. So regular follow-up with the doctor and following the doctor's advice is extremely crucial in prevention of formation of stones. These are the common misconceptions regarding uh, renal stone and its prevention strategies. So if you have any advice, reach out to a doctor and get your myths demystified. Thank you.